Take the Saturday. Watch your feet. You already know it's your boy position. And shout out to my nigga Gunzo with Guns O motherfucking films. This nigga shoot videos, this nigga shoot movies, god damn it. Keep that shit going. It's got marijuana. Nick Solo, bitch. You already know who the fuck I am. I go by the name of Position, artist, producer, and motherfucking official DJ of motherfucking shit. Feel me? Goddamn right. I'm from Eastside Watts. Feel me? I'm from LA, nigga. Through it through. You feel me? All right. I take that everywhere I go with me. Um, just like everybody. Just like everybody in the hood, man. You know? You get your violence. You get your bullshit. You know? Niggas grow up selling dope and all that type of shit. But it's love. You know? I've been DJing for long for about 14 years now. So, you know, I had a nice long journey. But before that, I was never a DJ. The Wish Ball and Crazy Ball made me a DJ. And I didn't even know I was about to be a DJ until we was on our way to Australia. And they were like, hey, man, you, you know how to work this? And I was like, oh, no, I don't. And, you know, I don't, ain't no buses going back from Australia to L.A., so, you know. You was, was pretty much yeah, stuck. Yeah, I was stuck. <laughs> it didn't take away. It was just more the fact I had to, I had to kind of pause the, not even pause the rap shit. I just had to literally uh, focus on my craft as a DJ a lot more. But ain't, no, ain't nothing going to stop me from rapping, producing. I make beats every day, no matter what. Um, but if anything, this shit made me a lot more free. Yeah, like, no, no, like, I literally, you know, I'm going to always be on my West Coast shit, but I grew up listening to Midwest. I grew up listening to motherfucking Up North Cali. You know, shout out to the Bay and all that shit. I grew up listening to East Coast. You know, like, I know everything. But then I find out about, like, Detroit and their music. Then I find out about DC and their music, Go Go and all that type of shit. You know, I get to find out all these different types of music that everybody don't necessarily get to hear. I'm going to just I'm gonna keep it real, keep it that well. I feel like there is some artists that really take it serious, but it's a lot of other artists that just look at music as a come up, as a bad. And that's where the you know, shit falls off at. When you think you just gonna make money and just say anything, any little catchphrase, that's where you fall off at. Nigga, we have one hit, like we call it microwave music. So, you know, that's when some of them fall, but you do got some niggas that's really about their shit and make time to work their face. See that all the time. It ain't, they don't even have to come up to me. I see the motherfuckers. You standing next to these niggas think they don't like the whole thing. But at the end of the day, you still gotta put in work. Don't put in work, nigga. Just because you stand next to a millionaire don't make you a millionaire. You just next to a millionaire. So you gotta put in that work to get your shit.